What is up people YouTube, it is I, the Mario Bros. 17, or you can call me Vinny, and today we're taking a look at the SH Figurettes Ultimate Gohan or Mystic Gohan. This figure is a good one, but a lot of people disapprove of the reuse of Goku body parts. So, is, it, is the figure still worth it? Well, let's not waste any time and take a look at the sculpt. Now, obviously, I can't complain too much because, well, Gohan did wear this in the Boo Saga. So, I know it would be kind of unfair to critique that, but still. There is nothing wrong with reusing body parts, but this, but this Goku mold needs to go. One of these reasons is for this stupid shoulder cut joint, which I overlooked in my previous Goku reviews, including Vegito's review. This looks ugly and does not need to be here. And when you reuse it three freaking times in a row, yeah, yeah, three freaking times in a row, uh, in the same year, as a matter of fact, Vegito, this figure, Super Saiyan God, Super Saiyan Goku, you're doing something incredibly wrong! And of course, the way the knees are articulate does not look good very either. They need to do something like they did with Krillin. And that was a smaller figure. Think about that. But other than that, everything else uh, on the body looks fine. Of course, the newest thing about this figure is the head, Gohan's head. Now, the head, it looks good. It looks just like all Ultimate Gohan. Had no complaints there. So, yeah. It's good. Don't worry. <laughs> The, the hair sculpt is actually just like Vegito's. It actually has sculpting instead of looking, you know, blocky. So, yeah. I definitely pr proved that. And you gotta love that awesome curve that Gohan always has. Looks awesome. So, sculpt... It's... I can't complain, but... You need to stop reusing some of these, some of these parts. Paint job. This is a hard part. For one good reason. I don't think a Gohan is supposed to have this lightish orange color. I just rewatched the, the, the Boo Saga episodes of the anime where Gohan was, you know, beating up Super Boo. His clothes were a bit more red. I'm not sure if that was a mistake on on the device I was watching it on, but still, I, I I'm pretty sure Gohan's clothes is supposed to be is supposed to be like a darker orange or or, or uh, an orangish red, but but not a light orange. This is why I say stop reusing the, the Goku body bolt. This is why I say that. It's just... Why? Just why? I can forgive the blue, because that's supposed to be on there, and it does look nice. There is a... And of course, in the orange, there, there, there are some sh 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 shading effects uh, on here. So yeah, the, 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 that looks good. Uh, I like it. That's fine. And also, the boots... Again, they look uh, pretty nice and accurate. Nice. And of course, the newest part, the head. Which is, you know, the hair is obviously black, the Saiyan black, and the eyes are... I don't, I don't think they're sculpted on there, they're, they're painted on there. <laughs> Just completely pa painted on there, so, yeah. I really don't have much complaints there. Paint job will lose some points. If you already own uh, Sun Goku, Super Saiyan, or normal version, you know what to expect in the articulation. First off, the head. The head is on, is on a ball hinge. The neck is also on a ball joint. It is pretty stiff on mine, so yeah. It can still move. Arms are on a, a, a ball joint. A ball hinge, I should say. Shoulders. Well, the shoulder pads the for the close ball joint to block that obvious gap. Bicep swivel, double hinged elbows, and ball hinged fists. And a ball jointed waist. Definitely can't move, definitely can't move. Legs. The typical pull down style figure, art, figure arts hinge to give it more range. And legs are also on the ball joint. Can swivel a little bit. The knees, they work, but again, this thing just needs to go. And feet are on a ball joint. And toes are on a hinge. So, yeah. Articulation, you know what to expect. It's not bad by, uh, by any means, but still. <laughs> it's the sculpt and the paint job that kind of kills it. 
For our size comparison, we have the SH Figure Arts Vegito and the SH Figure Arts Piccolo. And as you can see, they are nicely in scale, though I think Gohan is supposed to be... I think he's supposed to be shorter, but at the same time, I think he's supposed to be taller, so I'm not sure you decide. But this is why I keep saying stop reusing the same body mold. <laughs> It's lazy, it's stupid, and, and, and I know why they're doing it, they're trying to save money, but sometimes it's not, it's not, some things are just not worth saving money for. I'm sorry. Uh, uh, the size comparison's okay, so you still got your Dragon Ball Z display if you want it. Oh, but wait, we're not done yet, it is accessory time, and Gohan comes with plenty of accessories. So, he comes with two interchangeable faces. He comes with this screaming face. I like it. I I don't have much of issues with it. It's Gohan. You know, screaming. We got a we get a smirking face. It, it looks good. Except for one thing. The eyes are uneven. Is it supposed to be like that or am I just lo losing my mind? It looks uneven. Look at this. This one's lower than that one. Is that supposed to be like that? I don't remember seeing that on, on the pro promo images. But even then, it should be be even. And Gohan's like do do smirk. Now like this weird smirk. I could be complaining too much, but it's just kind of me being picky. So I'm sorry. We get these uh, open palm hands. Well, not open palm, but still. The fighting stance hands. The kamehameha s hands. And the splayed out open hands. I'm not going into too much detail about the hands because they're literally the same exact ones that came with the, uh, the original Son Goku. I'm dead serious, they, they're, they're even reusing accessories. Uh, yeah. But the new one is my favorite, the Masengo. The, uh, the sculptor looks great. I like it. Yeah. As you can see, it looks very nice. Has a, a nice creamy white uh, uh, on, bo on both sides while in the middle, it's a nice glittery, not glittery, it's still a yellow, so yeah, there's that. One thing I don't appreciate is this mold line here. Are you kidding me? Really, 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 and even more freaking really. Thanks, Bandai. You're real pal. You also get a stand that it comes with the beam, so there you go. So, in terms of accessories, they're fine. Yeah, they're fine. So, what's the final verdict on the SH Figurettes Ultimate Gohan? Sculpt, stop reusing, reusing the mold. Paint, should have been red or, or, or dark orange. Uh, articulation, same. Uh, uh, size comparison, it's good. Uh, and accessories, uh, they're fine. Uh, I have no problem with the accessories. And I know, I know, I know, I know, I know. I shouldn't complain because this is the same. Mo this is the same clothes that Gohan wears in the in the Boo Saga. But there was no reason to reuse the mold. The proportions are kind of off. With that said, I apologize, but this figure is getting a three point five out of five. I don't hate this figure. I like it. It's it's just it's just. I, I'm kind of disappointed with it, uh, uh, honestly, you know, like, the, the paint, it should it should have been a darker orange, not this light orange bull crap, and, and also the, uh, the, the mold, reuse the body if you had to, okay, fine, but, but replace those, those damn uh, uh, arms, uh, as well as the legs, they don't work great at all, they've aged, it's just, why? Uh, I, uh, uh, I I'm sorry if I'm being negative in this review, but that's kind of the, but uh, and pointing out ju just the cons. But that's kind of the point of a review. You you need to pull, but you need to uh, address uh, some of the flaws with the figures. I I don't just uh, I I don't just honk ba Bandai's uh, stuff uh, or, or anyone's stuff for that matter. But still, but still, yeah, uh, you heard me ramble enough. Do I recommend this figure? Uh, well, if you like Gohan, uh, absolutely. If you like Dragon Ball Z, absolutely. Um, it, um, it, if you're if you're just that guy that wants everything to be perfect, this is not the figure for you. And if you're just that one the one guy that wants to complete the Dragon Ball Z as he figures collection, then yeah, this is the, the figure for you. If you're just that casual the casual guy that wants a, a good figure, assuming if you don't have the original Son Goku, then yeah, go go ahead pick this up. But if you already do, the thirty five dollars really ain't worth it much. 
So anyway, with that said, I'm the Mario Bros. 17, and I am out. Make sure to hit that like button, subscribe, and comment. Again, this figure is not bad. Uh, I don't hate it. I like it. It's just, you know, it has flaws. Anyway, guys, I'll see ya.